Okay, we are going to do a quick one here. This is Coats and Dresses. We are starting it off with the love of my life. This coat, I love it. Do I have anywhere to wear it living in Southern California? No. So I am absolutely begging to go to New York and wear this this fall. I think this is gorgeous. Very classy, classic look. Absolutely dying for it. It's 43% off. I think that is a very good price. I really want it and I hope I can buy it and I hope I can have somewhere to wear it. Okay, I love her. I will not be getting her because I don't think I'd wear her enough. I love her. A great vibe. A great price. She looks warm. She looks comfy. She looks cozy. This whole fit is just chef's kiss. Delicious. We love her. Okay, I do actually really like this. I wish it came in tan. The black is gorgeous. I just think the like tie coat type thing, exquisite. We love it. Um, yeah, I wish it came in tan. I don't really like, for some reason the black just isn't doing it for me and I don't like that pink. Okay, I love her. This is gorgeous. I do not have $820 to spend on a coat, but I think she is gorgeous. She looks like a spring flower. She looks so soft, so warm, so cozy. I think her toes are cold, but whatever, that's her problem. So yeah, if you have $820, you should buy this coat. Okay, similar vibe, not quite as cute, but like a better pink, uh, purple kind of thing. Hyacinth is what they call it. I like this. She's not, she doesn't have a little, a little, uh, tie that you wrap around but she's cute too 170 not too bad again we live in southern california we will not be wearing these outside so if you have somewhere to go that is cold i recommend this coat okay dresses i like this i couldn't wear it because it has a cutout right where my bra would need to be and i cannot wear a backless bra so this is going to be a no for me, but I actually really like this print. It's giving me very, like, 80s, 90s, grandma's couch, grandma's outdoor furniture vibes when you visit her in Florida, you know? So I actually really like this. I think she's funny. I think she's cute. Would recommend. I'm obsessed with this dress. I don't know why. There is something about it that, like, I would so wear would so wear it if I could pull it off. I really don't think I could. And it's $80 and I don't know where I would wear this. So I'm going to have to say no. But someone else should buy it. Okay, I think this dress is so cute. Um, I have a Reformation dress that's kind of like this, but mine is white. So now I'm very interested in getting it in black. I don't think I took a screenshot of the other color, but the other color is really cute too. So I actually really like this. We should all buy them and match. Okay, I like this dress a lot. I don't really like the other color. It's a little too much for me. But I really like this one. I think it's so pretty. It has little flowers and it has little ruffles at the top. And there's like kind of like a ruffle detail type thing at the bottom that I think is so cute. I love her. It would look great on me because I look great in this shade of blue. However, my ladies will not fit in these little lima bean sized cups that are for the boobs like that is absolutely not happening and i hate it and it would look absolutely ridiculous if i tried to put it on so that is absolutely devastating but someone please buy this because i know you all will look so cute in it and then i can just be jealous of you okay all right gorgeous all right we have made it to the home and beauty portion of the sale okay you absolutely cannot go wrong with a Barefoot Dreams blanket. They come in great colors. I am obsessed with this camel. They're, they truly are Barefoot Dreams. Like, I, I cannot explain how soft they are. And I do have a robe that I got as a gift, and it is truly the softest thing I've ever felt. And I would kill to have a blanket, but I'm not going to pay $98 for it. I wish I would, but I won't. So one of you should. Okay, I'm also a fan of this blanket, $66. Like, that's a pretty good price. Um, I cannot attest to the coziness and comfort of Nordstrom brand blankets. 
as I've never tried one, but I do love this color and she does look really cute. Okay, y'all, I thought this towel was a blanket. I was like, that looks soft as hell. If I had $50 to spend on a bath sheet, which I, bath sheets are better than bath towels. Don't get me wrong. But in, in all essence, it is still a bath towel and I don't have $50 to spend on it. But if I did, I think this would be the bath towel because it looks so freaking soft. Okay, Nordstrom has really entered their Etsy instant photography downloads phase. I just feel that I could have bought this for $5 and had it printed at my local Costco photo center, RIP, and put it up. To be fair, this does include the frame. Not that it's that amazing of a frame, but like I have to give credit where credit is due. But like truly, they're truly in their Etsy phase and good for them. But I think you should just go on Etsy and buy something even better. I will say, I love this so much. I would not buy this because it is a wooden mural. However, I did find it online. It is the Surfin' Art Print by Emma Boys, B-O-Y-S, Boys. I will be buying it from Society6. I absolutely love this. I cannot explain it. It is absolutely going on a gallery wall directly next to the photos of Hannah and I from the fair. So I, if you haven't seen those, please ask. I will be sending them to everyone I know. Um... Yeah, I just, I'm absolutely buying this, but not from the Nordstrom sale. Please don't buy this wooden mural. Although if you did, like, honestly, I wouldn't judge you. Just, I hope you all aren't spending $150 on this. Okay, I just bought bedding, so I don't need new bedding, but I think this is so cute. Uh, it's, like, $180, so a little on the expensive side, but I think it's so cute, and if I hadn't just bought bedding, this would have been a contender. I love it if you're looking for bedding please consider this. I'm in love with this cutting board. I never thought I'd say that about a cutting board. I think it is so cute. As a strawberry purchaser and consumer, I would love this to slice my strawberries on. It's so cute. $30 I think is expensive for a cutting board. I don't know. I've never actually bought a cutting board myself. Um, but I love this. She's so cute. I hope she's good quality. There are no reviews. Hopefully this would be something I could see in person. I'm not counting on that at all, but I will try when I go to the sale. But I love her. I think she's cute. And there's one with the flowers if you don't own one with strawberries. It's not as fun to cut your fruit when the fruit itself isn't illustrated on the cutting board, but, you know, there's only so much you can do. So I also like this one if anyone is in the market for a cutting board. Okay, back to towels. Why do I want this so bad? It's $40, which I feel is a little pricey, but she looks soft. She's a pocket, guys. She's a pocket. This just seems like a great idea for me to get, and I can wear it when I'm dysoning my hair. So please let me know if I should get this. I think I need some opinions on this one. Okay, sunscreen. There is so much good sunscreen. Okay, this one, strongly considering. I think it's only, is it three? I think it's like three things. Like their pictures are all mashed up. Um, but yes, so it has, okay, I don't really get this new thing of they're giving you a full size and then a mini. There are so many things on the sale that's just a full size with a mini. And I'm like, I don't necessarily want all of, my beauty items to have a mini because first of all I don't do that much traveling some of the items I just don't care enough to have a mini of I will just bring the whole item I do agree like it does work with sunscreen put it in your purse that's great also speaking of on the go sunscreen they do have this it's only two items sorry the pictures are mashed up but this has the glow stick I've never tried it but I've heard good things so this seems like a very good deal. Okay, this one is a really good deal. I didn't think so at first. It's $33, which 
the main item itself is 30 and then the refill is 20 so truly is a $50 value for $33 so I think that is a good deal so I would recommend okay this has bad reviews and I need you guys to hear me out I've read through the reviews and everyone's saying that it's overpriced because you could buy all of these items for $30 and that would be 90 so you're paying nine more dollars okay those people are idiots because this baby has Olaplex number three, number four, and number five. Number four and number five indeed are about $30 to purchase separately. So that's $60, right? Olaplex number three that is sold in this is the Jumbo. The one that costs $30 is I think less than half this size. So this is a fairly good deal. The Olaplex number three jumbo costs about $60. So this is about like, you know, about $20 savings, I would say. Because it's like, you know, 60, 60, 120 is about the real cost. It says 137. I don't really think that's true. I am an Olaplex girly. I love my Olaplex ponytail, my bun that I leave in for hours on end for no real reason. So I would recommend Okay, I'm absolutely kicking myself because I just bought a new face a couple months ago. I had no idea it would be on the Nordstrom sale. I bought the new face mini from QVC. I did get a good deal on it. I think I paid about $150, so not a huge loss. But this is a very good deal. And if you are interested in a new face, and if you're not, please research them and see if you're interested in them. This is a very good deal. I would suggest looking at QVC because I paid 150 but like you get more included like I think the thing that's 150 on QVC right now has a bigger um gel that you're supposed to use with it and it has a brush to put the gel on and it has um they're like wipes for your face like I don't quite know what they do but it has a bunch of those so you do get more whether or not you want those things is up to you so would you rather buy it from Nordstrom have it be cheaper or like get the other stuff that's included I believe this only comes with the new face the charger and like a mini version of the gel so anyway also if any of you are listening you cannot use aloe in replacement of the gel. Please do not do that. I see people doing it all the time. You cannot do it. You need to use like the medical grade like ultrasound gel if you're going to get something cheaper than the actual new face gel. Aloe vera does not allow the currents to travel through your face. So please do not do that. Okay. I bought the new face mini. I was thinking about the new face trinity which is like the full size one. It's a bigger device and okay so the trinity has a removable top and you can have other attachments on it i probably would have bought it for 199 if i had seen it but keep in mind the attachments are like 200 or 150 dollars each you can usually get them on sale but you know that's still like 120 or so that you're probably paying for each attachment and ladies i'm sorry we are probably not old enough to need these attachments they're like all these like anti-wrinkle things so i was thinking mini and then in like five years if i'm like wow i want to start really preventing wrinkles then i will invest in the trinity that's my thought process back to sunscreen because i didn't organize this album anyway I vibe with this. I haven't tried it. I'm a Kula fan. I, first of all, love Sentence on the Greens. But this is a good deal. I did check. the. It has a full size and two minis, I believe. Although I will say, actually, now I'm kind of changing my mind because SPF 30 is not good. Like, that is not enough sunscreen, ladies. So, no. This is actually a no for me. But if it where higher SPF it would be a good deal because the or if you don't want high SPF because 
you guys can all tan and I can't. Um, the full size costs 25, I believe. Tw- yeah, it costs 25 and the two minis cost $10 each if you were to buy them anywhere else. So this is a good deal. If I would wear SPF 30, I would buy this. Okay, I think this is a pretty good deal. I'm a Gimme Brow fan, so I would purchase this if I needed it. I don't believe I need it. I might. We will see. I should probably check my stock of my pencil. But I'm a Gimme Brow fan. This is a good price if you want to get it. Okay, I'm also a Brio Geo fan. I also saw that they have another one that has like the scalp massager. I have to say, I have that scalp massager. I never use it. I feel like it, like my hair gets too tangled in it and it doesn't do much. However, I might not be using it correctly, so it's very fair. Um, I think this is really good. I have the first two. I have the deep conditioning mask and the charcoal. I like them. I'm very intrigued by this avocado and kiwi hair mask. So I would recommend those. Okay, I have the heat and UV protector. I like it. I'm a big fan. The full size, it is a big ass bottle. Like I am not even part of the way through it and I've probably had it for about a year. However, I use heat on my hair maybe once a week. So I'm a big fan. The mask looks good and great. We have another mini. What would I do with this? Although I will say it is a big bottle, so it probably would be good to bring traveling. So I take that back. It is useful. So I would recommend this. 35 is a pretty good price. The thing that I bought was probably, I think like $28 or something, either 20 or 28, I believe. So it's a pretty good, pretty good deal. Okay, you guys, this one is not a good deal, okay? It says it's an $80 value, and sure, Sandra Pay and Ulta might sell it for $80. It is not a good deal. Okay, it says it's 13.5 ounces. I think the regular ones are eight, so this isn't even double. But I'm going to tell you a secret that's not a secret at all. You can go on QVC, and you can get two of the regular sized ones with two mitts, which I think Sandra Pay has like expensive mitts, but you can get two eight ounce ones and two mitts for $49, which is basically the same price. So it's not only do you get the two mitts, you get even more of the product. You get 16 ounces instead of 13.5. So, I mean, not a huge deal if you're looking to get like your Nordstrom points. I respect that. But I just want to let you guys know, this is not as good of a deal as they make it out to be. All right. As of now, this concludes our home and beauty. And I paired it with coats and dresses. I will probably add more. Knowing me, I will send you updates on the things I purchase. I will send you updates on things I add to my wish list. So, yeah. Okay, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much. Bye.